Biodegradable additives are additives that enhance the biodegradation of polymers by allowing microorganisms to utilize the carbon within the polymer chain itself. Biodegradable additives attract microorganisms to the polymer through quorum sensing after biofilm creation on the plastic product. Additives are generally in master batch formation that use carrier resins such as polyethylene, polypropylene, polystyrene or polyethylene terephthalate. Topic: <laughs> Testing methods of biodegradable additives. ASTM D551112 testing is for the anaerobic biodegradation of plastic materials in a high solids environment under high solids anaerobic digestion conditions. ASTM D552612 testing is for the standard test method for determining anaerobic biodegradation of plastic materials under accelerated landfill conditions. ASTM D521007 testing is for the standard test method for determining the anaerobic biodegradation of plastic materials in the presence of municipal sewage sludge. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Laboratories performing ASTM testing methods. Eden Research Labs. Respertec Ne Laboratories NSF Topic Biodegradation process of biodegradable additives A simple chemical equation of the process is C6H12063CO2 plus 3CH4 interpretation of this process is as follows. In most cases, plastic is made up of hydrophobic polymers. Chains must be broken down into constituent parts for the energy potential to be used by microorganisms. These constituent parts, or monomers, are readily available to other bacteria. The process of breaking these chains and dissolving the smaller molecules into solution is called hydrolysis. Therefore, hydrolysis of these high molecular weight polymeric components is the necessary first step in anaerobic biodegradation. Through hydrolysis, the complex organic molecules are broken down into simple sugars, amino acids, and fatty acids. Acetate and hydrogen produced in the first stages can be used directly by methanogens. Other molecules, such as volatile fatty acids VFAs with a chain length greater than that of acetate must first be catabolized into compounds that can be directly used by methanogens. The biological process of acidogenesis results in further breakdown of the remaining components by acidogenic fermentative bacteria. Here, VFAs are created, along with ammonia, carbon dioxide, and hydrogen sulfide, as well as other byproducts. The process of acidogenesis is similar to the way milk sours. The third stage of anaerobic digestion is acetogenesis. Simple molecules created through the acidogenesis phase are further digested by acetogens to produce largely acetic acid, as well as carbon dioxide and hydrogen. The terminal stage of anaerobic biodegradation is the biological process of methanogenesis. Here, methanogens use the intermediate products of the preceding stages and convert them into methane, carbon dioxide, and water. These components make up the majority of the biogas emitted. Methanogenesis is sensitive to both high and low pHs and occurs between pH 6.5 and pH 8. The remaining, indigestible material the microbes cannot use and any dead bacterial remains constitute the digestate. Topic: Biodegradable additive manufacturers. Breakdown Plastic Inc. Biotech Environmental LLC. EcoSafe Plastic. Hybrid Green. Biosphere Plastic LLC. Ecologic LLC.